నమస్తే వెల్కమ్ టు ఈజీ ఆయుర్వేద ఐ ఎమ్ డాక్టర్ సుదర్శన్ టుడేస్ క్వశ్చన్ ఈస్ ఈస్ చవనప్రాష్ యూజ్ఫుల్ ఇన్ ట్రీటింగ్ మేల్ అండ్ ఫీమేల్ ఇన్ఫర్టిలిటీ చవనప్రాష్ ఈస్ మెన్షన్ ఇన్ ద రసాయన చాప్టర్ ఆఫ్ చరక సంహిత ద చాప్టర్ విచ్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్స్ అబౌట్ యాంటీ ఏజింగ్ అండ్ రెజ్యువినేటివ్ మెజర్స్ సో ద ప్రైమరీ పర్పస్ ఆఫ్ చవనప్రాష్ ఈస్ టు డిలే అండ్ రివర్స్ ద ప్రాసెస్ ఆఫ్ ఏజింగ్ బట్ విత్ ద రివర్సల్ ఆఫ్ ఏజింగ్ rejuvenation of reproductive tissues and restoration of hormones are also seen so most of the anti aging and rejuvenation medicines such as chavanaprash are also useful to treat male and female infertility this medicine bestows maximum benefits upon the body when panchakarma detoxification is done prior to the administration of chavanaprash ఆచార్య చరక హాస్ మెన్షన్ ద ఫాలోయింగ్ బెనిఫిట్స్ ఆఫ్ చవనప్రాష్ క్షీణాక్షతాం వృద్ధాం బాలాం చాంగవర్ధన చవనప్రాష్ ఈస్ యూజ్ఫుల్ ఇన్ రివైవింగ్ ద టిష్యూస్ అండ్ ఆర్గన్స్ ఆఫ్ ది ఇంజూర్డ్ ఓల్డ్ పీపుల్ అండ్ చిల్డ్రన్ స్త్రీషు ప్రహర్షం చవనప్రాష్ యాక్ట్స్ యాస్ అన్ ఆఫ్రోడిసియాక్ శుక్రస్థాన్ దోషాంస్ చ అప్యాపకర్షతి చవనప్రాష్ రిలీవ్స్ ద టాక్సిన్స్ ఆర్ డిఫెక్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ ది శుక్ర that is male and female reproductive systems these lines clearly indicate that chavanaprash is useful in treating male and female infertility this effect of chavanaprash can be logically explained both from ayurvedic and modern point of views ayurvedic explanation in the human body the first tissue to be formed from food is called rasa dhatu it is the nutritious part of the food that gets absorbed by the gut and starts circulating all through the body the menstrual cycle and factors responsible for it are explained as artava artava is explained as a sub tissue of rasa dhatu the circulating nourishing fluid labho payo hi shastanam rasa dinam rasayanam that means the purpose of rasayana is to improve the quality of rasa dhatu and other tissues of the body so with anti aging medicines such as chavanaprash the quality of rasa dhatu gets upgraded along with it its sub tissue artava the female fertility factor will also get well nourished chavanaprash and male infertility we just have learned that chavanaprash improves the quality of rasa etc body tissues shukra the male and female reproductive system is also one among the seven dhatus or tissues of the body so with a good quality nutrition circulating all over the body the blood muscle fat bone etc even the reproductive tissues also get nourished and rejuvenated with chavanaprash this is how chavanaprash is useful in male infertility as well modern explanation new research on anti aging animal studies have concluded that anti aging therapy with molecules such as desatinib quercetin etc are proven to slow down and in some instances reverse age related fibrosis of the uterus in one of the anecdotal instances recorded by harvard genetics professor dr david sinclair resveratrol etc products administered as anti aging supplements in a post menopausal woman brought her menstrual cycles back though lab investigations ruled out any type of cancer causing uterine bleeding This clearly hints that anti-aging therapy can reverse the age-related changes in the female reproductive system. Resveratrol, an anti-aging molecule, has shown protection against reduction of fertility with reproductive aging in mice. All this suggests that anti-aging therapies of Ayurveda through Panchakarma and anti-aging medicines such as Chavanaprash are definitely helpful in treating male and female infertility. Thanks for watching this video to learn more about ayurveda please visit easyayurveda.com